First competitive game in charge, how are you feeling going into it? I'm excited to be honest with you, really excited. Um, boys are buzzing for it and to be honest, during pre-season, it's, the games are good but it's not quite got that competitive edge to it. You know, everybody knows it's pre-season and you try and not treat it like a pre-season game or a friendly for whatever but um, it's some aspects it does. So we're really looking forward to it, I'm looking forward to it, the coaches are. Um, there's a real buzz about the change rooms, we're just looking forward to getting going, to be honest, really excited about it. Well, um, pre-season, obviously, as you, as you said, a lot of the lads understand it is pre-season, but some of the results maybe didn't go our way mm -hmm. throughout pre-season. Do you believe that that's going to affect the lads at all today? No, no, and to be fair, I can see that straight away. Um, we kind of put an emphasis on it at the start, that we're a brand new, we're a brand new team. Um, we've only re-signed four players from last year. Um, 18 of those are brand new players as well, so for us it's just getting better every week, progressing on week. Um, and I can see that, I have seen that right from the first game against Creetown, um, right to last week against the ASR, which they've all been tough tests, every single game has been a real tough test and I've learned a lot about them during the hard games um, and it's, it's been good, it's been really good to be honest and I feel as if I've probably learned more about them in those games than I have if we maybe played lesser teams or easier teams. Um, so to speak, I don't mean that disrespectful, but um, I, I've been quite impressed with the progression. And for us, even just now, even today, it's still about progression, and that'll be the case for us all season, always striving to be perfect, um, and as close as we can to being perfect. And that's no difference today. Um, a lot of it was just the lads getting to know each other. A lot of it was learning my style of play, and how we put it in place and getting used to the coaches and not even just the coaches, even just getting used to the facilities and the, the guys running about the committee who have been brilliant, um, which again, it's, it's going really good to be honest um, and we're just we're hoping to get off to a good start today. So coming in, coming into uh, St Cuthbert's last season was a rather successful season, um, do you feel the pressure at all to try and live up to the standards that were set last season? I don't, know. No, I don't. Um, I can see why you probably ask that question, to be honest, but I don't feel the pressure at all. I think Jordan and his staff and the players done brilliant last year. Absolutely brilliant. Um, and to be honest, it's probably made our job harder in a way because we need to try and come in and do better than that, to be honest. You've always got to strive to be better than what you were the year before. With that. I know they've obviously made it a lot harder for us because they won a treble, they won the league. We have a lot of ease to be honest with you, um, but we're going to try and do that better. And that's the that's the sort of challenge that's laid down to us from the team before. But just credit to them and it's up to us to follow suit and make sure that we can strive to be better. A lot of new faces in at the club, obviously. Um, for a lot of supporters, it'll be a lot of unfamiliar faces. Mm -hmm. Is there anybody in particular that the supporters should be keeping their eye out for? Um, Conor McDonald would probably like me to say him. Um, but I don't know if that would be because he's ability on the pitch or he's just a moaner, I don't know. <laughs> um, but for me, no, he's, he's a good player, he's one of them. We're, we're quite exciting in the top half of the pitch, we've got loads of pace, power, creativity. Um, the back lines should be solid, it'll get solid as the season goes on. And um, we've got good young players in the middle of the pitch, who'll fight and great for everything. Um, to be honest, I think all the lads have got, they all bring something different to the table for me. Um, but we will, you'll see a lot of the, the quality shine through, hopefully through starting today, I'm hoping to see the quality there. And there's always someone during the season that will surprise you that's maybe not quite standing out in pre-season, there's always somebody that will that'll jump out at us. Um, and I'm sure that the fans are in that comes down to watch, they'll pick their own fan favourite when they come in. But for me, um, they're all the same, they're all a wee bit, they're all a wee bit mad. Um, the changing room's good, they're good for that. But um, no, they're all talented players and it's just a case here. I just want to give them the platform to show that. Brilliant. Well, best of luck for today Excellent. and thank you very much. Thanks very much, mate. Cheers.